This is my buddy slash big brother Michael Gunner here. Tell us where you're from, Mike. I'm from Gladstone, Virginia. Tell us about the big house you got here. It's a 2017 Kenwork W900L with a 170 inch ICT custom bunk. It's got coach doors on it, heated floors. It's got the max of everything you can get, infinity ceiling and all that. <clears throat> and tell them, uh, you showed me the big road. My yeah. dad and everybody, your dad, they didn't want to go nowhere. They was all wood all life. So what I do, can I go riding in a truck at you? Yeah. How old was I? But I think 13, he was about 12, 13 years like old. That. Every summer, your mom would meet, a, meet when I was going out, or winter, whatever it was, yeah. winter break. And you'd ride with me all throughout the country and taught you how to take tarps off that's frozen and all that good stuff. Yeah. We're all from Gladstone. We got our own little thing with everybody. Just It's kind of a brotherhood. Yeah, we... I mean... We look out for each other. We all help out each other. Oh, I need a tarp, or I need this, or I need that. I'll come get it, you know, keys in it, whatever. Yeah. But um, tell us uh, what made you want to get this big bunk truck right there. Well, one big reason is my old lady, she's got Crohn's disease. And when she rode, it was hard to find Crohn's disease, make sure you use the bathroom and all that stuff if you know the disease. And she needed a bathroom to ride in the truck, and that's where we started looking into the big sleeper trucks. And in the wintertime, I'd go out for like three months at a time, stay down south, and I was paying motel rooms, and it cost so much for the motel rooms, and said, why not? You know? Now, tell them what you haul and what you pull and why you stay out so long and all that stuff. Well, we're a specialty hauler. Um, we're a heavy haul company, Miller Transfer is, and... We haul like robotic, nuclear, machinery, as in not roll-on. We don't do a lot of roll-on. We will do it, but very few times. And I pull a Conestoga most of the time, my own personal Conestoga, but I will hook to a company trailer and go to open trailer and throw tarps again. You know, I, I'm not scared of it. I'm still young yet. <laughs> Let me go bring Rachel on in and show the next addition to the fleet. Yeah, we got one in the oven. She's on the way. She'll be here any minute. Well, so what do you think about the big bump, Rachel? I like it, as long as he's happy. <laughs> That's the main part, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> well, I appreciate y'all. Thank you. And we're all big family. I hope y'all like the yeah. truck show here at all the antiques. Need a little new flavor, so yep. everybody get to see it. You know, you go from 36-inch bunk to a rolling <laughs> home, so yeah. it's, a, it's a reality shot. Well, I appreciate it. Yeah, right. I appreciate everything you do, Wayne. And like I said, it's like brothers. So. Uh, let me ask you, Mike, I'm going to throw something in there. Having Wayne ride along with you at the age that he was, you know, what, what do you think of him now doing what he does? What do you think of him? I mean, Wayne has developed into, you know, he's like one of my idols, you know, because he's evolved into an awesome truck driver and doing what he's doing, he has come a long ways and I'm so proud of him. And like I said, we think of Wayne as family, so. I appreciate you. Yeah, all the stuff you, you done you, taught you me. You love, brother. You know, uh, <laughs> getting on me and all that, I appreciate it. Because if it wasn't, I call, I got a question, I'll call you. You know that because yeah. you know the book, the green book by hand. So, yeah. <laughs> And we play by the rules. We don't cut corners, you know. You got to do everything right. If you don't do it right, then you ain't doing trucking these days. I mean, ain't no need in beating them. You may as well join them, you know. Yeah. Appreciate it, Michael. Yes, sir. Thank you.